And around that time, the Olympics roll around again. The Sarajevo Winter Olympic Games. And I'm watching them on TV. And I saw this little guy, he's about five foot one. He must have weighed 115 pounds soaking wet. And this little 18 year old kid wins a gold medal in figure skating, Scott Hamilton, right? When I saw little Scott Hamilton win that gold medal, he gave me hope. I said to myself, if well, that little guy can do it, I can do it too. I'll be in the next Olympics no matter what. It's a done deal. I just got to find a sport. <laughs> now, is that realistic, guys? I'm here to tell you that if you believe in your heart that it's possible, and your attitude is, I'm willing to do whatever it takes to make that dream come true, then it is realistic. I went to the library, got to do some more research. I'm looking at the list of all the summer sports. It took me five minutes to realize, man, you got to be some kind of a super athlete to do any of these things. There's no way. You got to be able to jump over houses or lift cars or run 100 miles an hour. I can't do any of that stuff. I got a little depressed. And then I started looking at the list of the winter sports. As I was looking at that list, I started thinking, you know what? I, I, I'm about to put together a plan here for the next four years. It probably would make sense to base the plan on my strengths. My strength's not athleticism. My strength's perseverance. I'm bulldog, remember? <laughs> so I figured, hey, I gotta find a sport that's so tough, a sport's got so many broken bones in it, there's gonna be a lot of quitters. Only I won't quit. That's it. That's my whole plan. You too can go to the Olympics, just don't quit. <laughs> so now I'm looking for tough sports. Ski jump, bobsled, luge. I live in Houston, Texas. <laughs> Hot, humid, flat, sticky Houston, Texas. There's no skiing over there. I never skied before, so forget ski jump. That'd have been suicide, right? And, and who are you gonna find four other nuts, or three other nuts in Houston that wanna do the bobsled? <laughs> I mean, you gotta go to Jamaica for that. <laughs> <laughs> so luge, I figured I can do that one by myself. <laughs>